Hello, Hello everybody. everybody. Today we are going to be doing Good Moon and Apron Part 2. Today I'm making the classic good grilled cheese. Do you have ingredients right now? First, you need um, bread. Oh, that's nice. Bread. bread. Okay, where's the butter? Butter? Ethan cooks and I eat. I eat my own food. I don't need butter. <laughs> yes, you do. Yeah, I don't need butter. The one, the ingredient. Bruh. My plate! Oh no, it's no, plate! It's, really it's already. Is it broken. plastic or is it gold? Not glass. First, you need your two your uh, pieces of bread. Bread. <laughs> and you need two more pieces. Oh shit! Oh, it's all over my compound. Then you need your slices of cheese. And don't forget your pan. I don't have the pan right now. Wait, how are you making it though? There's the bread. They're not tossing the microwave. How'd you know? Are you actually? No. Okay, about well, say. <laughs> you need your slices of cheese. Good old American cheese. Oh, just slice of cheese. More American cheese. What I like to do if I only have three slices left, I'll always put this a couple pieces of duck on the side so it fills it out. And they get the other the pieces and fill it out. Fun fact, folding the cheese gives you double the teas. Then you get your leftover, then you cover it. That. Then you get your other size of cheese. And you open it up. Uh, with the, um, oh, okay. Oh, I just, I just realized. I know what to put when you place down a piece of cheese. <coughs> then you get your your last slice of bread. Bam, bam. And then you put a side laser like this. Then you fill out the sides like what you did earlier. I'm still waiting for my grandma to get the pan. The pan? Yeah, because I don't have the pan on me. Are then, you you put, here? then you put your cheese in the middle. Then there's your slice of bread. Cheese on it. <laughs> and then you close it, you have your two sandwiches. And this is where Kevin's gonna come. Okay, I am back. So first what you do, you have to put butter on the bread, obviously. And then you have to put butter on the pan so it doesn't stick. Like that? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Let me show you. Like that. Like that. Mm. You wait just a couple minutes, probably a minute. 
put my iPad back down to the stand. Uh, goofy Goober. Um, always make sure to always check on the bottom. No. First, you always have to check on the bottom. Like that. Oh, shit. No. <laughs> Hold on, let me just fix the bread real quick, then I'll show you guys the bottom. But always, check the bottom, just in case. Just in case. And if your butter's gone, always be make sure to get new butter. Always be prepared, just in case you run out. If you run out of butter, always find butter like this. A package like this. It says butter on it. It doesn't matter whatever you use. Mm. I thought that was mayonnaise. It looks like one of those uh, packets that we have at school. Did you really use your teeth for that? All you gotta do is just rip it. Stop! Stop. Oh, you move your Check it. Uh, you move that to the side. To put your put your if you're able to move it lower. Ooh, it's not so good. See, it will melt like just like that. You have to move it a little bit lower since they can see only the handle. Just like that. Just like this. <laughs> I forgot to check it without saying I gotta open up the butter. How do you get for not checking it? Burned it. It's worth it because I'm, I'm teaching beginners. Now, now teach us how to remove the burntness. Um, it's called rubbing two uh two toasts together. Right. I'm gonna put that. I'm gonna put that video of people rubbing burnt toast part. together to remove the burnt part. Is that more butter? Woo, more butter! <laughs> perfect angle. It's the perfect angle, <laughs> though. Perfect. Look at all those pots and pans. Is that a wok? It burned! <laughs> It is perfectly. <laughs> oh no, it flipped. Wait, is it? It shows the bottom and top. <laughs> Alright, round two. Redeem yourself. Redeem yourself. Wait, before you put it on, make sure to get your butter. Butter. Make sure to get your butter. <laughs> I, th I thought you rubbed butter on the bread, not. I already did. Uh, okay, I was about to say. There's no way you just put just butter in there first. I mean, technically, butter is going in first. The cheese is melted, but <laughs> the bread is. Now, now open it apart. Oh, it's so hot! <laughs> <laughs> Try to open it. I need a napkin. I'm trying to show you the cheese. I need a napkin! It's so hot! Satisfying pull. Let's go. <laughs> that was not satisfying. All right, that was like one of the worst pulls. It's burnt. <laughs> What's the bottom part? Let's see the other part. Other side. The other side. The other side. There's <laughs> Ebert. See, it's hot. At, at least it's not. At least it's not that crunchy. It's a crunchy toast. <laughs> it's gonna be burnt. Oh no! Oh no! All right, let's go. Oh my God! I'm trying not to keep it. It's not burnt, folks. Ignore it. It is not burnt. It isn't burnt. 
it burned. He's a little bit butter. Butter? Man, look at all that butter that just came out of there. Here's a tip, folks. Make sure to get butter for your uh, uh, anything you cook because if you put butter on the pan, it will make it not it's, uh, stick. Uh, Aiden. Uh, Aiden. I think you should. I think you should check the bottom. I literally just put it there. Oh my god. No! <laughs> <laughs> I told you! I knew I saw something! Now, for the real answer. And make sure to always turn it off. And make sure to look at the bottom while you're turning it off. Now you gotta make sure. What is the pole? Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, it's gonna be not that satisfying. Okay, I'm you guys on me. Guys, look, he has a walk. You haven't pulled it yet. Oh, is it on the table? If the taste test, taste test? Yeah, taste test. Is it good? You don't like it because it's burn. It, it'll probably better. Better. It'll probably be better if you throw it into a toaster. Okay, that one was a little bit better than the other one. Because the other one didn't have any. Taste test from Ethan. Now cut it. Wait, you didn't even pull the other one. I did. Did you? Was it that one? Is that the one with the napkin? The napkin? Man, just your butter knife. Now pull. You can just pull it from right there. I I think I see why you couldn't pull it. You're cutting through the cheese. Oh, there's a little bit of cheese right there. You're cutting through. I think you just got to pull it. Put pull on it, yeah, pull, pull. Oh. There you go. Mm. Are those muffins? <laughs> yep. And disinfecting wipes. Folks, it's so good, it'll make you moan. Why do you have disinfecting wipes right next to your food? Fast forward on Ethan drinking water. Come on, eat really quickly. Be Matt Stoney. Nom 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 nom. Do it. Do it. You got this, Ethan. <laughs> Just go nom nom. Grab some water as well. Be Matt Stoney. Eat, drink, <laughs> soak the bread in water. That's all you gotta do. I thought you just had the sunny. Alright, ready? Oh, that one's better. That one's better. Oh, Matt Stoney time. You gotta clear out that. Now you gotta go. No, 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 dip it in water. No, 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 Go! <laughs>
No, it's not. No, it's not. There's more. See you in the future. Like and subscribe and eat some tacos. Goodbye.